Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. In today's video, I'll show you how to repair Windows 10 or Windows 11 without needing to reinstall it. So, if you are experiencing issues like corrupted files, slow performance, or Windows update problems, these methods can help get your system back on track without losing your files. So, let's get started. First, it's always a good idea to create a system restore point before making any changes to your system. This will let you roll back to a working state if something goes wrong. Here's a detailed tutorial on how to create a system restore point. Once you have successfully created a system restore point, then you can continue. However, now we will use a command line tool that is designed for advanced system management and repair. It can help to fix system corruption, repair Windows image, and even manage Windows update. First, open command prompt as an administrator. To start, let's run a basic check to see if there are any signs of corruption in your Windows image. Type the command dism space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash check help and press enter. This command checks if your Windows image has been flagged as corrupted without making any changes to your system. It's a quick way to get an overview of your system health. If the check health command did not find any issues, you can go one step further with a more detailed scan. Type dism space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash scan help and press enter. This command scans your system for corruption and logs any issues it finds. This step may take a few minutes depending on your system condition. If DISM finds issues, the next step is to attempt a repair. Now type the following command DISM space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash restore health and press enter. This restore health command tries to automatically fix any detected issues. DISM will connect to Windows Update to download any necessary files for repair. So make sure your internet connection is active. Sometimes DISM might have trouble finding the files it needs online. In that case, you can specify a local repair source. This could be a Windows installation ISO or a repair drive. If you don't have, then you can follow me to download a Windows ISO file from the Microsoft official website. Once you have download, right click on the ISO file and select mount to assign it a drive later. Now open the drive and go to sources folder. Inside you should see the install.wim or install.esd file which contains essential windows files for repair. Note, if you don't see install.wim file, sometimes the install.esd file is present instead of the install.wim file. In that case, use the file path of install.esd in the command. However, now that you have identified the drive letter of your installation media, now run the following command dism space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash restore health space forward slash source colon now paste the path of install.wim file 
space forward slash limit axis and press enter. Adding forward slash limit axis tells DISM not to use Windows Update and to rely solely on local source. DISM will now attempt to repair the Windows image using the file in install.wim. The process may take some time depending on the extent of the corruption as system performance. Once completed, you will see a message indicating whether the process was successful. Another helpful DISM command is start component cleanup command. This cleans up older version of Windows update files which can free up space on your hard drive. Type the command DISM forward slash online space forward slash cleanup image space forward slash start component cleanup and press enter. This command helps remove unnecessary files from your system's component store, helping save space and potentially improve performance. You can also analyze how much space you could save by running this command. DISM space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash analyze component store and press enter. DISM will give you an overview of the component store and show you how much space could be reclaimed by cleaning it up. It's a great way to access your storage usage. Finally, for the most thorough repair, combine DISM with the system file checker. Start with DISM to repair the image. Type the command DISM space forward slash online cleanup hyphen image space forward slash restore health and press enter. Then after it completes, run the SFC tool. Type SFC space forward slash scan now and hit enter. This sequence ensures that your Windows image is healthy and that any missing or corrupted files get replaced. This two-step process is great for tracking stubborn system issues. And that's it. With these DISM commands, you can troubleshoot, repair, and even optimize your Windows installation. Just remember to always run command prompt as an administrator and to use a local source if DISM can't find what it needs online. So, I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question or any advanced guide, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share, we need your support and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you, thanks for watching, have a nice day.